These days, no matter what your site, your business, your objectives, one mantra that you'll come across time and time again is this, content is king. With Excite Pro, it really is so easy to add a whole range of different content types to increase your site's content density, be it using your own original content or that of a third party. And it's this latter content type, content from third parties, that the inbuilt RSS feeds wizard makes it so easy to add into your site with Excite Pro. The RSS feed wizard enables you to bring in timely, relevant information to your site's pages, as you can see in this example here. Here we've got a sub-page list linking to some other pages on our site, and we've complemented that with some other news, which in fact is an RSS feed. So let's take a look at how all of this works in Excite Pro. I'm just going to close this browser now. We can see here in Excite Pro, here's the template design. Looks great. It's a sport-related site. We've put a fictitious site together called the trackpro.com. Uh, about track athletics and so on and uh, we can see we're on the page layout tab well if I go over to the web pages tab we can see here we have a news page uh, and below that news page on the left hand side we have some sub pages which in fact are the news articles now those news articles are already listed on our page here using the handy sub page links list that's for another video topic but over on the right hand side here we have a space into which we'd like to insert that RSS news content. Remember, relevant timely information that's going to appeal to our visitors and potentially it's going to bring those visitors back to our web page. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to right click in the space that I want to insert that RSS feed and from the powerful right click menu that appears I'm going to select the RSS feed wizard module. Now the module that appears when, when we click that link is a simple two-step process. The first step is for us to actually select from the thousand feeds available one that's relevant to our web page visitor. So we're not going to go with business, so I'm going to collapse that list and we can see all of the different categories here of RSS feed content. There's a huge selection, as I mentioned a moment ago, a thousand feeds and of course you can add your own feeds too. But what I'm going to do just for this demonstration is select a sport related feed from the list. I'm going to go with an Olympics theme, the USA Today Olympics coverage. So if I click Next, here on the RSS settings screen, we can actually change the settings specific to this RSS feed, how it's going to actually appear in the web page. Why that's really useful is that just by making some changes to the colors, the padding and things like that, the width, how the RSS feed is displayed in our web page, we can really kind of blend it into our page content. And that's not to say we're trying to pass this RSS feed content off as our own. We're not. We're just trying to make that RSS feed complement the existing content that's already on the web page. So I could go ahead and change uh, settings, uh, change the font sizes, really make it um, appear exactly as I want it to appear. I'm happy with the settings that we've got here on this uh, screen already, so I'm just going to go ahead and click Insert. Here's the placeholder frame in the page that we could, of course, right-click and edit the properties for if we wanted to go and tweak those settings later on. But I'm happy, as I say, with the defaults that we've, uh, we've used, so I'm just going to go ahead and click this Preview button in the bottom left-hand corner to see how that now appears on the web page. Clicking Preview, of course, loads our favourite browser uh, in which it displays the web page as it will appear when it's published. And if we just wait a second for that to display, we'll see, of course, there we are, nice and neatly, the RSS feed in all its glory. So, to round up very quickly, RSS feed content, as I mentioned at the outset, a great source of third-party content that can complement your own. It's relevant, it's timely. You have a selection of a thousand different feeds to choose from, so you should have no problem matching some RSS feed content to your site traffic. It's another great way that Excite Pro enables you to uh, increase the content density of your site and to add value for the uh, visitor's browsing experience. Again, hope you enjoy using this tool.